Hey up! Hey up! So, welcome to the vlog. Welcome to the vlog. It's Friday. It's Friday. I'm, uh, there's no work on today, which is a bit of a shame. So I thought we'd uh, head down to the truck, give you a bit of a tour around, and uh, I need to do a bit of cleaning as well to make sure it's all ship shape for, for next week. Uh, I think I'll do uh, wash the truck next other week, I'd mind, but uh, yeah, we're gonna head down. Been a bit of a strange week, we didn't have work on Monday or on today. Uh, just a bit more time like to uh, sit and do a few things, but yeah, we're gonna head down um, and give it a go. So, I'll see you in a minute. Right, so oh, here we are, we're at the yard. There's my little truck. Look at that. Beautiful. Anyway, let's get on right. Give me one. I've got my little bag of cleaning stuff, you know. Some nice clean cloths and whatnot, so let's get in. I had to go back home and get the keys because I might have forgotten them. But we've got them anyway. But let's get on. I'll give you a bit of tour of have a good look around the truck anyway. Fair warning though, she's a little dirty. It's been a miserable bloody week in uh, England, for weather-wise, so let's just get on, eh? So there we are. She's a daft. She's a daft. Got home blood services written all over it. Daft XF. And uh, she's a 510, apparently. And I just love that little saying, look at that. Yes, little muck, look at the muck there. Look at the muck. Certainly need to get that washed. Right, let's just get up in here. And we'll give you a good tour around the uh, around the truck. So, right, shoes off. Shoes off. So let's give you a little tour around the truck. So naturally, we've got a nice cab area. Beautiful, decorated in orange. Absolutely stunning. Got a bed area and stuff, uh, which is a bit messy at the minute. Um, and then it's got the double decker. I mean, look at that. Absolutely beautiful. I do love the fact that it's got Yorkshire plastered all over it. So yeah, it's not a terrible mess in here, but you know, you, you've got to work in a nice area, aren't you? So we'll give it a go, we'll give it a go.
E, much better, much better. I shall make the bed in there before I go. But yeah, it doesn't take long to do, it doesn't take long to do at all. So, a couple of other things that I've learned this week um, and I'm a bit surprised they don't teach you this stuff on, the, on your test when you do your test. So first thing that uh, I've been trying to use this week has been the engine retarder, which is this little gear lever here. Okay, so you've got different strengths. So normal and then it just does the uh, braking for you. Which is a bit weird because I've now started turning the window wipers on in the car because I'm going for the engine brake. Who knew? Who knew? The other thing that I've learned as well is these little buttons. So you've got your cruise control, so you can set it or you can resume it, you can go up and down. Bog standard, you've got your limiter, again, off, and you set that with this side here. And the other thing, which I think is really cool, is you've got your bra engine braking for going downhill. So you can set it at 56, 57, 58, whatever. So it won't take you over the speed, it'll just keep you nice and level which I think is pretty cool. Absolutely pretty cool. And, and it kind of comes in invaluable because you're, you're not needing to worry about then sort of managing your speed going down, down the hills because them motorways are quite deceptive and you know, they, they do creep up on you where you don't actually think that there is a hill there. Uh, all of a sudden you can be going uh, pretty quick. So quite, quite good that it's got this sort of kit on it. Uh, naturally this truck has got these uh, horns I'm going to call them silly horns because, well, I'm not a massive fan. When you've spent time at Truck Fest and people playing bloody baby shark on horns all the time, you kind of get fed up of them. Um, however, it's got a proper trucker style um, horns on the top as well. Um, and you pull that by that little switch there, uh, which is quite cool as well. Uh, I've only done that once or twice, but uh, they're pretty loud. Pretty loud. Anyway, the, uh, yeah, so th this week has been a bit work shy. Uh, I mean, I've, I've managed to get Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday in, uh, which is uh, which is good. Uh, I didn't bother recording the footage because it's just going down to Milton Keynes and back. Uh, and I just thought we've seen that a few times, so we'll uh, we'll not bother with that one. And then uh, hopefully next week we'll get uh, a bit more work on. Um, but rather than sit at home and do nothing, I thought, well, I'll come and uh, clean up my mess. I mean, they want a mess in here anyway, but you know, clean, clean up the muck and whatnot because otherwise Stacey will have me. So I'll get this bed made and uh, make it look all tickety-boo and then we'll get back home. Um, I, I still need to download my card, um, which I'm doing off my own back because basically I don't want to, I want to be able to keep an eye on stuff as well. So I bought a card reader, but I'll go through that in a minute when I get back home. Um, and I need to go and take my car for a wash because it is bloody filthy. My little cars down there. Um, and I need to put some stickers on it. So I might just do that on this video as well. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, let me tidy this bed. I'll get some more shots and then uh, I'll see you in a minute when I'm back home. Look at the state of this. Look at the muck. Anyway, so that's that, that's that, truck's nice and clean, I might just go and get the car washed because, well, why not? I've double checked everything, it is all locked and tidied up and uh, whatnot, I've not left out in it, so we're all good, we're all good. Put it to one side, I need to just nip and get some pennies and then we'll go and uh, get the car washed. So let's get the car washed. I know I'm going to be lazy and I've gone to uh, one of these uh, hand car washes, but uh, well, sometimes well, you've got to support local, aren't you? I mean, these boys work right now. So yeah, I'm going to spend a little time this weekend um, getting to uh, grips with uh, having a look to see what work we can get, uh, which is, we just turn that engine off. Yeah, have a look and see what in, what work we can get. See if I can get a contract. 
some working. Now it's getting pretty loud in here, so I'll uh, cut here. So when we're all back home and it's nice and clean, and we'll get some stickers on this bad boy. In a minute. Whoa, much better. Right, now that the car's somewhat clean, I've been, I've had these for a while to be fair. Some of my most favourite people. And I went and ordered all their stickers, so let's just get them on, shall we? Let's just get them on. Player base. And we'll put that, uh, this is where it takes me 10 minutes to uh, peel the uh, back off a sticker, isn't it? It's that way, that's the way. To do there, I think. There we go, player base. Now then, we've got uh, G Balling 23. If you've not checked him out, you need to check him out. It's absolutely hilarious. Now, I think we'll put that one just there. Hold them in half so I can place it first and then uh... hold about that. That'll do, won't it? Now we've got Ambo's shiny. Ambo Man sticker. This is like a special, special edition, so we'll have to put that up here and I'll... Put that one there, I think. Right, oh, and then naturally Falco won gaming. I had to get this one specially made. There we go. What do you think? Hey, so I mentioned earlier about um, actually getting a card reader. One of these things. I think it was about 18, 20 quid or so. Um, I was just so that I can keep an eye on my hours and card and everything. Um, I know Gary does that for me as well, but uh, 
there's no harm in uh, making sure that I've uh, covered all bases as well. So literally, you're just bobbing, bobbing that in there. Make sure that the uh, thing's plugged into the USB, of course. I'm gonna bob my card into the little reader. Bob the card into the reader, and then I'll open it up on the uh, Takamasa software. Now, it takes a few seconds to uh, to bring that up, but this uh, has brought up uh, an infringement on the 14th, which was uh, my first day. Um, so it brings up everything, the last activity, all the hours and stuff that I've, I've got on there, uh, and so that I can keep an eye on it. Uh, like I say, it's not, not compulsory, you don't have to do it, I just figured that I want to keep an eye on my home, it's my responsibility isn't it, to make sure that I'm within my hours and stuff, so I thought I'd uh, Give it, a, give it a whirl. Anyway, I'm gonna stop waffling. But before I do, I have got some stickers. So I've got five stickers here. The first five people to go and like Holmeswood services on their Facebook page, I will bother link in the description. First five people that go and like that page and send me proof, I'll send you a sticker. I mean, you can also get them in the merch store, but why buy one when you can get one for free? Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed it. Like and subscribe, all that kind of jazz. Take it steady and I'll hopefully get some decent footage next week. Take it steady. Bye-bye.